Roy mastering the impossible. Uh, please welcome Siegfried and Roy, along with some of their buddies. Good. Uh -oh. You have to pick up the little, Jay. What is it, Kimbo? Oh, what is yours? it? Yours. How you go? Oh, they're cute. How you guys? All right. Which yeah. one you pick? Oh, God, they're all beautiful. Oh, okay. Yeah. There we go. Well, so nice to see you guys. Now, how are their names? How, what are their names? How big do these guys get? They get well, the one where you have is Jaipur. He was the last born. And I guess in a year, you won't want to have him on your desk anymore. <laughs> They're going to grow up to about 700 pounds. Yes. 700 pounds? Yeah, really? 700 pounds. Wow. You don't sit on your desk anymore. Huh? You know, you know, don't sit on your desk. You know, it's a, you know, I went to see your show, and I must, you know, could people say, like you said about Las Vegas, people say, oh, magic. Oh, all right, I'll go see the magic. Man, it was, un it's the most unbelievable show I, I think I've ever well, seen. I, I'm telling <laughs> you, you know, you say about magic, that's what happens to us. <laughs> that's all. Right. This is a good thing. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, so now you know that being. <laughs> <laughs> no, you, you forget that they're tigers. You think they're kitties, and you go, how cute. Yeah, they Ow! They <laughs> well, Jay, this is one thing we don't want to do. We never want to change the tiger. But as if you're an will always stay a tiger. And that's <laughs> the best thing, right? <laughs> Actually, we have the largest cat house in Nevada. The largest cat house in yeah. Nevada, really. <laughs> but you know, you know what I love about the show when I go see it? I, I really get the feeling that you guys really love the animals. Because so many times you see shows and guys are out there snapping whips and not... You know, the animals really seem to, to, to take to you. It's, it's really amazing how you... Well, it's a part of our family, yeah. you know? <laughs> yes. Take him away, Roy. <laughs> well, we, we started 10 years ago with a breeding program. The Maharaja of Baroda came one day to our show and uh, he felt that we were the one who could save the white tigers. Yeah. So we started with the first breeding program and uh, we started with two and today... Alright, all right, he's alright. Uh, you know what happened? Hey, get out of my water! What happened? Good excuse. Uh, <laughs> you know, it's amazing. It's Aren't ama you glad you don't, don't have a, uh, a, a week on or a... <laughs> I know, a week on. Well, actually, that is our welcome in Las Vegas. <laughs> now, let me, now, how did you... Now, you guys have been together for a long... <laughs> you guys have been together, what? Over 30 years. Really? Over, over 30? Now, where did, where did you guys... And we, uh, now 25 years in Las Vegas, you know? We and the first time, that reminds me very well, our first uh, arrival in, in Las Vegas was 25 years ago. And the owner of the hotel said, uh, what are you doing? Don't tell me you're a magician because magic doesn't work in this town, you know? But the opening night, the opening night, <laughs> they worked with a cheater and I transformed Roy into a cheater. And... Uh, uh, the first time we worked with an orchestra pit, right? Yeah. With an orchestra pit, yeah. and we had a conductor in front of it, yeah. and he had a toupee. And we went. He had a toupee. And the and the tiger took it. Exactly, and the cheetah was so enhanced by him, jumped to him, took his wig off, took his toupee off, <laughs> and landed on the piano. That was our opening. That's right. Funny. And that was the first standing ovation we ever got in Las Vegas. I'm telling you. Now, you guys live with these right in your house, right? They just rent well, they live. <laughs> They're safe. They have the run of your house. They live in the largest cut house in Nevada. <laughs> That's what it is. But do they just run through the bedroom and everything? You... Uh, well, not, not really. No, not yeah. all the time, you know? <laughs> now, Roy, you, uh, now you've been with animals since you were a little kid, right? You worked in the zoo. Did you start, yeah. out, did you start out in magic? And then, hey, what are you doing? Give me... <laughs> <laughs> did you start out in magic or did you start no, out working with animals? No, I didn't start out in magic. I actually, we had, after our uh, childhood, we were born in Cosmo, Germany, we had it pretty rough. So uh, I had a, a wolf 
which actually... A wolf? Yes, I was six years old, and she actually saved my life several times. No, wait, wait, you had a wolf at six... And wouldn't a wolf just eat well, a six-year-old? No, he didn't. It was a wolf, it was a wolf hunt. No, 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 no. See, we never agree with each other, yeah. right? <laughs> Hey, hey, stop eating my book. Now, this is our book. Now, this is our book. This is our book. <laughs> <There Right? you laughs> I can see that we don't get a word in. I always like to be upstaged by animals or by children. It's always the best part of everything, right? Okay. This, <laughs> one, this one, Shamir, realized that my sweater was once a lamb. Oh, really? <laughs> see? <laughs> now, are these, the, are these the first ones ever born in captivity? No. We no. started this t uh, 10 years ago, this breeding program, with two tigers. And as you know, these tigers, they're to totally extinct in the wild. Yeah. These are totally extinct? Totally yes, extinct yeah. in oh, the wild. Oh, that's really sad. Isn't and it? since now 10 years, now we are Siegfried and Roy, our family is, has now 27 white tigers, 25. <laughs> <laughs> he loves the book. <laughs> and as you know, a tiger usually um, reaches an age in the wild, a, a regular tiger. Now, how, uh, this show is like the most expensive show in the history of Vegas. Like yes. It's like a $30 million show, isn't it? Something uh, like that? Uh, don't be exaggerated, it's $25 million. $25 million? Yeah. <laughs> it's good enough. But, uh, you know... <laughs> It's amazing. We, uh, when we open up our show, we, uh, we rehearsed about uh, two months uh, before we opened up. And we have this, uh, well, first of all, we have 27 animals on stage. Yeah. But the worst one was, uh, we have a 35 foot high... Uh, Pyro spitting dragon. Dragon, mechanical dragon. Which tries to pin So now we time. start to rehearse this thing. And um, I said to the guy, uh, please uh, bring that dragon on stage. And he pushed the button to make him walk on stage, this dragon, huge dragon. <laughs> anyway, but he didn't know how to stop that dragon. <laughs> so the dragon walks right out to the casino, yes. walks right out to the casino, uh, uh, an elderly woman walked up and says, what a great slap machine this is. <laughs> Reached great. between his legs, got the jackpot. <laughs> oh, I made that up. No, no, I made that up. I don't need it. Well, that made me rash very happy. But we enjoy Las Vegas. Las Vegas is well, a great you know, town. It really, is, it really is the greatest show I've ever seen. And I mean, it gives I, I, us a I'm chance to share with our hear? audiences. I, mean, I, I was tigers. amazed, and I, I recommend yes, if you're in Las Vegas, you perspire, you check perspire. it out. Check it out and yes. see it. We have to make these tigers disappear. Hey, close that book. Be right back. Right after this.